Hey there, fun day 39. Sharon Hornell from here, also known as Pajama Grandma, doing something fun today from our little journal book. Do one fun thing every day. Doing a 365 day fun challenge for a change this year. People do challenges to get results. They do challenges to get business results. They do challenges to get physical results. They do challenges to get any kind of result they want in their life. So I decided why not do a challenge to get more fun in our lives, right? I don't know about you, but the older I get, the less fun I have. A lot of people are better at fun than I am. So I thought, hmm, let's focus on fun this year. I hope you're doing it right along with me. They're little things, just one little thing every day to move us more toward the fun life that we all deserve to be living. So let me grab my handy dandy magnifying glass so I can show you what we've got today. The little do one fun thing every day book. And we are on, I don't even know what, they don't have page numbers in here. So we just go, I just go right through it. I go right through the book. It's easier. That way I don't lose my place. And I put on this cute little red tab to make sure I know what page I'm on. So what have we got today? Good for nothing. A cucumber should be well sliced and dressed with pepper and vinegar and then thrown out as good for nothing. Samuel Johnson said this. And our challenge today says these foods should be thrown out as good for nothing. So, what foods do you just dislike intensely or hate? You just can't stand them. You're not going to eat them. There's no reason to have them in the house. What foods do you think are good for nothing? I feel kind of that way about okra. Okra is one of those foods that I just, I've never gotten to like. I never found a way to like okra. It's just a weird little green vegetable. And I'm a huge vegetable eater. But I lived in the South for um, a few years in the 80s. And... I okra was everywhere and I just couldn't stand it that and Asiago cheese I know Asiago cheese there's this big phase and when I was working for a big industrial bakery we made Asiago this and Asiago that Asiago cheese bread and the days that we made that in the plant I I couldn't stand it I had to like do things to get out of the office because it smelled so bad to me but people love Asiago cheese so what is some food or some thing that most people think it's good and, and love to consume, but you just can't stand. Share it in the comments below so we can all um, see how many things we have in common that we don't like. Have an awesome, fun day, and I'll, of course, be with you tomorrow.